everybody doing today? Thanks you for checking out another video on APG Gaming. So, um, I would also like to say the apology for the mic audio in the last um, video, but we're going to go ahead and try something new today. Um, so, starting off, we're going to be looking at the new Call of Duty 2v2 gun match tournament, okay? We're going to be looking at the different details on that and how... So guys, I know, so right now, the tournament is actually in beta testing. So I also know that they have the time limit for you to sign up in the game, um, to get in the tournament. So it places you with one person, and you play with that one person to end the tournament, basically, and, um, you see how far you get. So in this game, I pretty much got until fifth place. I didn't get you far because I did miss a shotgun match, but the match is pretty good, cool. Um, so now here's what I think pretty much about it. So let's go ahead and look at the build quality of it. So the, of this tournament, I actually think it adds something more to do and it kind of gives you a little bit more challenge with 2v2 because 2v2 is already challengeable, but um, it gives you a little bit more feel for a little bit bigger challenge to see if you would like one or, you know, kind of gives you more bigger challenges so you kind of add more things for you and a friend to do. I know in addition they are adding, um, you know, they're adding all enemies or moves, capture the overtime flag moves, to win. Kind of that concept we're doing the 3v3, it, um, with a lot of people excited about they're just coming out. Oh, that's <laughs> um, so yeah, I am liking this game mode a lot. The tournament, I'm liking it a lot. Um, also Stay as hungry. well, um, yeah, so, um, yeah. Much of other 2v2 um, so far in this game, so it's really nothing when you have to use it, just kind of putting the best skills you have. So, as for placement, I started looking at the leaderboard, right? And pretty much everyone was, me, so I don't think you're making a spy for him. Keep at him. I don't know if you can leave in the comments so far what you think about this match is ready too as well. And I know that there's a lot um different speculations about this, about maybe placement. Um people that are maybe a little too high or not. Me personally, like I was just saying again, um, people I was playing with were a little bit more high leaderboard than I am, not saying I'm just gonna scale a little bit, you know. Um so people are starting off that might become an issue. I don't think they're accounting for that yet, but they're still in beta, so we'll see how it kinda goes down the line. Guys, uh, again, choices. Um, I had a few Shake concerns with that. So the weapon round. choices. It kind of was a plain, um, how to say, it? kind of a plain, um, the same pistol layout. I, I had the next match, but kind of pretty much was the same thing that um, kind of annoyed me, and it was kind of sad that it did, because um, you know, like. That's how we put this. When you're playing 2v2, you want to get a lot of game selections, but when uh, I don't know, you put this when you when you keep your happy game selections, right? It kind of messes up the experience a little bit because um, you already know you're not good with that weapon, but, but it keeps putting you to use that weapon. Not all the things. Um, like the fact that for some new players, that, that might not be the best bet. Do you want them to get a kind of a circle around? Thing? Not like a bad, but uh, let's, let's, um, let's go ahead give him a and, uh, proper English welcome. The what what Call of Duty says about this new um <laughs> website. All right, we're going all with. Here we go. So how to play the Modern Warfare 2v2 gunfight? Just like last time, Modern Warfare gunfight tournament mode features 16 teams of two players, each in traditional bracket style of play. For those who need it. We've in included a picture of a sample, which I have in my, I think it was a thumbnail, or you will kind of see it throughout the video. Gunfight, okay, so we, so there's no loser bracket, so just keep winning to the preliminary quarter finals, semi-finals, and finals. Join up like you would any other match and wait about five minutes in the match waiting tournament to begin. So like I was saying, if you missed the five minute cutout, you gotta wait for another five minutes to build off that, but we'll go into that. 
Santa rules a 2v2 gunfight with me. You do almost capture the posing dual flag. I did not do that. It was just eliminate the amount of two players. But anyway, our best tip is to work our way to the flag as quickly as possible as most inexperienced players likely aim and kill condition while playing the objective. Okay? That is also a big part of that because I have seen that happen a lot. So I'm gonna have to recommend I do agree with that because um, I've seen it happen a lot. And um, that is a pretty, pretty good piece of advice. So I'm gonna have to say yes, I do agree with that. Right. Now, um, okay, so let's keep let's keep looking into this. So, why the extra tournament hasn't changed much? The words are different from last time. So I did not get any words this time. Nah, I gotta actually go look into that. My bad. Um, cover me, calling cards, 500 XP, diamond charm. You get a diamond charm. So pretty much just kind of basic uh, prizes. Nothing too exciting. Um, so yeah, so if you look around and you, know, you see a lot of videos, and this did try another beta one out in November, but this is the second beta until it fully comes out into this to Call of Duty game mode, as is the regular staying Call of Duty. Um, I do have to understand that, well, back my day, um, so we're gonna, have, okay, so let's, let's take a look at, um, so anyway, I was trying to mess with my sensitivity because I was having some issues here, but besides that, that kind of won't be kind of your case. So the machine guns, yes, I kind of like the machine guns they're using. Um, kind of the custom build to them, I kind of did appreciate a lot, and I'm, I'm going to be straight, I, like I said again, I hate the pistol class. The pistol classes are bad, and I just didn't really did appreciate those. But as for everything else, though, I feel much, I, I mean, I was, the guns were pretty much decent, okay? I mean, there wasn't nothing too exciting or nothing too out of nowhere, but they were pretty much decent. Um, so anyway, uh, I'm going to leave y'all to uh, just kind of watch the rest of the gameplay and enjoy that. But before we get to that, I just want to remind you guys to also like and subscribe. And um, we'll have some new videos out as soon as possible. Just leave in the comment what you, you want to do next and we'll go from there. Thank you. Two wins down. Keep up the pressure. Gunfight. Eliminate our enemies or capture the overtime flag to win. Put them in the ground. 